we finally made it into Gibraltar. I've brought my watch in, I'll have to pick it up tomorrow. I've got two more watches that need new batteries. All my watches died at once. I didn't have a single watch between us that worked. Hopefully that will be rectified very shortly and we're just popped in for some breakfast while we're waiting for the watches so we would have their new batteries. And we're in, uh, we're in Casemate so Square. Good, and um, we'll have a spot of brekkie. How are you doing, darling? Yeah, doing great. Trapped in Gibraltar for a few hours. I've got a lot to get on with on the boat. Oh yes, did you get your paint? I've got my paint, yes. Excellent. And for the first time in uh, all these years that I've owned a boat, I have hope she will live. I had a very good day on it yesterday. Went for a run first thing in the morning. Then uh, I was really hammering away at that boat for about four or five hours. Burned my back. But it was very hot yesterday. Then we went shopping. Then I had to cook dinner. It was a busy day yesterday. Yeah, I'm going to go shopping, didn't we? Yeah, yeah. So, hopefully, we'll be able to crack on this afternoon, about 12 o'clock. Well, Fiona will be cracking on. I, um... <coughs> well, I've come this far without your help. I'm sure I can manage the rest. And the, the biggest thing is I've got to get that starboard engine unseat. I reckon it's fucked now, but I saved the port one. I'll give the starboard one a try. Engine room next stop. Oh yes, we're going to be doing the engine room. Oh my Fiona's God. going to be doing the engine. Big heavy hatches. We need to fit some sort of lift dampers. dampers yeah, yeah. yeah. Sort that. That'll be a, that'll be a challenge. Well, that was great. We got the the uh, both watches sorted out, new batteries, and uh, Fiona got her paint. And we're just waiting outside the shop now. She's in the shop, and uh, she's going to get some fiberglass matting, I think, for her for her boat because she's on with the boat. So that was really good, we're really happy with uh, that and I've got to go back tomorrow to pick the Timex up, I'm having an, a domed um, face put instead of a flat glass face and he's going to put a new battery in it while he's there and uh, check everything is working okay. So I should have the Timex back tomorrow which will be a great help as well but I mean just having no watch at all is really irritating because I've got to keep getting my phone out to see what time it is. I know these little things, little tiny things, but you know, it's sorted. 